everyone, it's Froggy, and I'm back again with another episode of the 100 Baby Challenge. So, uh, Susie has aged up. I don't remember actually getting a message about him about to age up, but either way, he aged up. So, let's go ahead and get him all set up. Uh, so we'll say that he is, oh, he is smart, motor skills, he's not really rambunctious. I wouldn't say that he wants to talk to everyone and make friends friends exactly. He is smart. Smartest kid in school, though. Succeeding in the arts. Well, I mean, you know what? Susie was interested in the culinary arts, so we're going with that. Um, pick a trait. Really don't have a whole lot. Uh, Susie skills a toddler and him a bonus trait. Creativity, motor skills, social skills, mental skills. Oh, there we go. Okay, I was really confused for a sec. I was like, what? Uh, so, creative, genius, no. Self-assured, no. Cheerful, eh. Oh, I got these back. Hooray. So, a bunch of my mods stopped working, and now I'm using all these other mods. So, I guess it's working okay now. Jim and I are unapologetic for themselves. No, okay. Uh, Natural-born leaders with major control freaks. They need praise and compliments. They're cocky, usually optimistic. That doesn't sound like him. Okay. Uh, crave stability and have very high work ethic. They're very career-oriented. They rarely apologize and rarely forgive you. Uh, if you've done something wrong to them, they're... No. Uh love of money Is it what it would, uh kings and queens of overthinking and try their best to master everything their talents uh they're highly selective and love hard when they do love they don't like feeling as if they've settled they always want the best very emotional very moody little smart mouth no uh honest, love to have things go their way, are sometimes crazy, and have severe anger management issues. They also have jealousy issues. Uh, impatient and blunt. They're usually very emotional and yet closed off. Uh, why would anybody do that? Very odd and unique. Stubborn. Never take any advice. You just let them mess up in their own life. They're down to earth and humble. They're very jealous and possessive. Look, he has some abusive tendencies. Jesus. Uh, very sexual beings. Je no, maybe not. Uh, loner, good, outgoing, mean, evil, lazy, kleptomaniac, loves the outdoors, glutton, slob. Okay, so you have glutton, but you don't have foodie in here? Where did foodie go? I guess you don't really get that until you can actually start cooking. Um, I guess Tauros made the most sense, so we'll do that for now. Where is he? There he is. Aw, honestly, he's pretty good the way he is. Let's uh, plan outfit. Okay, let's uh, let's see what we've got for you here. Not this. Honestly, I like the hair. This needs to go away. Okay, so let's start with your everyday outfit. Mm. I mean, it's not bad. I think I prefer you in just white. That looks good. Let's see. Do you have... Do you have socks on? You are not wearing socks, my dear. There you go. You are wearing socks now. Let's see what you're... No. I don't like that. Um... Oh, so handsome. Why are your shoes red? 
And what about socks? No socks. White socks. Okay. Very brown. You, you can keep that. That's fine, you know? See, now you're wearing socks when it's inappropriate. You're fine like that. Do we have... Great a match. There you go. Looks fine. Party outfit. No. <laughs> no. Um. No, I don't like that. Um. That's kind of cute. Um. Here, we'll give you some slip-on shoes. So that way, I don't have to worry about you needing socks, and you'll be fine. Maybe yellow to match your bow tie? Sure, there you go. Uh, swimming? Great. Sh sh you know what? <laughs> you look like a lifeguard. You're fine. Um, I don't like the pants that you're wearing. You can have jeans and... Maybe let's give you boots. Oh, winter boots. Oh, there's like actual winter boots. Look at that. Okay, there you go. And you need socks. White socks. Okay. I think you're good to go. Alright, so we're back here now. This is him here. He looks great. He is hungry. Oh, oh dear. Okay, he's very hungry. Um, So I'm just gonna go ahead and skip up. And we're back. So Jin is an A student now, which means that we can go ahead and age him up. Um... Where is he? Uh, oh yeah, they just came home from school, so it's good. Everybody's a little worse for wear. We've got a couple of people who are stressed out. Oh, but not so bad. So these two went into school really stressed out. I let them slack off in class and now they're fine, which is good. He's honestly really energized, which is fantastic considering I got him to work really hard and I mean, it paid off obviously. So the fact that he's energetic after all of that it's good stuff. It's good stuff. Okay, so we will do this. There's already candles on this cake. Um, so we will have you... Can we get you to blow out the... Yeah, okay, so good. So come here. Go here. We'll have you... Go here. We'll have you... Go here. I'm sorry. Go here. We'll have you... Come here. I don't... You're here too, so we'll just have you go here. Mate Hutton wants to come over. No, that's okay. And you're reading a book to the child, so it's okay. So we'll do that. Everybody come here. Oh my god. Gardus. Jesus, buddy. Okay. Um, here. Make a wish. Oh. They got horns. They got noisemakers. And put down. He's an adult. Now, uh, I think I'm still going to move him out of the house. But, um, oh god, I forget what the sister's name is now. I've been playing with these characters for lo so long and I totally forgot her name. Where's Sayori? See, I keep wanting to call her Jen, but I feel like that's wrong. Either way, she's about to turn into an elder, so I'm gonna need one of the boys to hang back with me anyways. But I think I'm just gonna keep Gardas. I'll probably just end up keeping whoever ages a blast. But Jin is a bookworm. He's a perfectionist. And let's see. Hmm. Rile up the other sims, become angry when targeted with mischief. No, I don't really want that. He's certainly not cheerful, creative. See, now I don't really want to put him as a genius either. While he is really smart, I really want to, like, show off his sadistic side, but I'm not sure which one to use for that. Not erratic. Loves the outdoors. Slob snob, maybe? These sims can critique lo work on low-quality items, are bored by lowbrow television, and gain confidence around other snob sims. 
These sims gain powerful moodlets from career success, negative moodlets from career failure, and may become upset if not promoted. I like that. Sims admire and brag about... No, that's definitely not him. I think I'm going to put him as ambitious. He's certainly not evil. Jealous? That's... Yeah, he's definitely jealous. These sims get jealous more easily than other sims. They gain a boost of confidence from being around other being around their significant other, but get tense if they haven't seen them recently. Well, you're not really going to have a significant other, probably. So we'll put you as ambitious. There we go. Look at you. Okay, so let's add more birthday candles to this before someone tries to eat it. 14 hours. Everybody's thinking about him. I think they're all congratulating him on his birthday. Oh, look at him, shucks. He is an adult now. You reek. Okay, so. Good. You're an adult. So we are going to go ahead and kick you out of this house. All right, so I think I'm going to stick him into the really household with Zaya because he's all alone. I guess everybody in this house must have died. Whoops. So I'll stick you in here for now. This way, I know that you'll be fine. You'll be, you know, you'll have more space because there's only the one of you. And I'll get you a nice job and everything like that. So, goodbye. I hope you enjoy your time there. I hope you didn't just take some money with you. That would not be good. I don't know how the money works. Give me a sec. Um. Oh no, okay, I didn't transfer anyone. They just have a lot of money. I gave them a lot of money so that way they could live, like, you know, nice life after everything that they have to get put up with. Um, no, go back though. <laughs> you are not getting transferred over. There we go. All right, well, I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode here for today. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you want to see more videos from me, then don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.